Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Ooch back again, once again, and we added with another quick one. It's a one take, quick shot. So we're gonna obviously this. This is not gonna be a rant, all right? We're good. We're we're done uh, with the rants for the day. But we're here to talk about some good news, some Pokemon Gen 8 news. All right. So really quick, this key visual came out earlier today. Now, um, a lot of people, specifically Serebii. I, they, they're really thinking like this is unconfirmed. I don't know and understand why they're really being avid, avid on uh, not confirming it or believing that it's real. Um, there's a lot of other people out there that are really going with, yes, this is real. So we're going with it, all right? So right here we got Ash, of course, back again once again with Pikachu. So you can... And stop holding your butts so you can release all the ha's and uh and the freaking that breath you probably were holding if you were hoping that ash was coming back because yes he is back okay he's back with pikachu like nothing ever changed all right except his clothes and the design which we'll get into for a little bit and then of course his new friend which actually funny enough i did see on twitter some people were comparing him to one of the uh characters from the I Choose You movie, which is actually a really cool comparison because they actually do kind of look alike. Um, and then this character, unnamed for now, has a score bunny, which is also interesting, I would think, because normally, um, well, I mean, not to say, I mean, Ash does normally get one of the starters, and assuming, uh, I guess he's not going to get score bunny. He's probably going to get one of the other ones, Sobble, or uh, I'm, I'm forgetting the name of the, of the grass one already, but... There you have it, all right? So here's the, the key visual. Again, it's literally teasing how they are going to all of the previous regions. We don't know for what reason, but they're doing it. You can literally see Charizard, my man Charizard in the background, Snorlax, you can see Lugia, you see Dialga and Palkia in the corner, Restaurant Zekrom. There's literally all the regions, all within this big circle, obviously, uh, all around surrounding a Pokeball in the background. Um, and there you have it. It's going to be starting, uh, start airing on the 17th of November. Now, I'm sure that's just for Japan. I don't have any inclination as to if that's going to um, be kind of like a worldwide thing. Uh, it would be kind of nice, but that is yet to be seen. Also, really quick, let's talk about the designs a little bit. So, Ash's design uh, changed a little bit from the Sun and Moon anime. And that's a uh, design typing that... A lot of fans um, still are kind of up in the air about, and they, it's not, I mean, I shouldn't even say they don't really know how they feel about it. A lot of people just don't like it. Now, I'm here to guys, to I'm here to remind you guys that Nintendo, Game Freak, all the parties involved with creating this anime, they got one thing, they got one thing on the, on the brain, the one thing, the one focus, the one target is the children. Okay, they're trying to appeal to these this new generation of kids that's obviously playing Pokemon, right? They're going to want to make the kids feel more gravitated towards a bubblier, more rounder looking character. You know, this is the most Ash has ever looked like an actual cartoon ever before. And, you know, and you when you think of it that way, there's really nothing wrong with his design. I don't think it's bad. I just have a another understanding of it. Like, my personal favorite design Ash has ever had has been from XY. That design was OD. It looked so clean and crisp. And I thought, like I said, it was the best one. It made him look a little older. It actually made him look how old he should be, which is like around 16, give or take, right? But I'm sure he's still going to be 10. And it's just it's just the direction of how they're gonna how they're gonna take things, kind of how like I said in my last video about what happens now. If you haven't watched it, please go check it out. Um, I was saying that Ash, like that, that, I was hoping that they take it they take into consideration you know the older generation of fans and they you know they they provide some kind of aging process you know to make these characters feel so that everyone can feel more connected to it because I mean. How long are you going to make this guy 10? I mean, come on now. Like, it's, it's literally been over 20 years. It's been over 20 freaking years. I'm over here 26. My man's still 10 years old. Go go watch the What Now video that I did about Ash winning the, the championship. 
Oh, sorry, spoiler, but yeah, he he finally freaking won the championship. Um, in the in the uh, the uh, Alola region, not in the Gala region, but that's the thing with this show, man. It's gonna be interesting because we don't necessarily know how they're gonna manage the new generation, like the new area, the Gala region, while going back. And they made it sound, they made it seem like the traveling is gonna be crazy. Like, like, think about it. They, like, they didn't have to take a whole plane to get to freaking Alola in the first place. They go in a Kanto to Sinnoh to Johto to freaking Hoenn to uh, Yanova, like to Kalos. Like, they're gonna cover all that in one anime. I mean, granted, I'm sure that they're gonna have like subtitled, you know, continuations for the overall series. Like they had X Y, then they had whatever, and then X Y Z, all that. You know, advanced, advanced battle. You know what I mean. I'm sure they're gonna have that kind of. Um, they're gonna have that that kind of pattern that they're gonna follow for this as well. They they ha- they, they haven't stopped, so why 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 stop here? But it's gonna be interesting. I I'm 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 not I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of looking forward to it because it, you know what that means to for me is that obviously we're gonna we're gonna revisit a lot of characters. We're gonna revisit a lot of Pokemon and I yo. Yeah, when Charizard comes back, y'all better let me know if I fall off on the anime, all right? But I'm looking forward to Pokemon Sword and Shield. For those that were wondering, I will be getting uh, one of the games. I, I, I don't know which one yet. But, yeah, that, that's that's about it. I, I think uh, at the time of this recording, there's supposed to be some kind of official um, reveal or release or more news overall about what's actually going to happen with this Pokemon anime. So stay tuned for that stuff, guys. Uh, we'll probably have another update video similar to this so that way we can just get get the content rolling um i might stick with this format um for the sake of just getting stuff out there so that way um it doesn't really inter- intervene with a lot of the other stuff that i have going on with my streams and my other videos that really do need the actual editing that i like uh to do for you guys um in my events and my you know tournaments travels all that kind of stuff so yeah this format might stick so hopefully you guys don't mind and you're still supporting the boy so that all being said let me know what you guys think about this new generation of pokemon the anime or your thoughts what you got like dislike leave it all in the comments below like share subscribe hit me up on twitter all the socials are going to be in the description below as always make sure you keep it locked tight and classy and right here on lucha games channel i'll see you guys next time